one of the playoffs saw all four home teams flex their muscles and show their credentials by gaining solid victories to make the very most of home court advantage. Cesca Moscow welcomed Severna Zvezda Telecom Belgrade to the Russian capital and Zvezda started well, but Milos Teodosic came off the bench to get Cesca going. The host soon moved ahead and pulled away to a double-digit margin several times after half-time. Zvezda fought to keep it close and Cesca only pulled away for good in the final five minutes as Teodosic finished with 23 points to give the hosts an 84-74 victory. Fenerbahce Istanbul hosted Real Madrid for a rematch from last season's semi-final and Bogdan Bogdanovic and Epe Udo provided the early highlights to give the home team a double-figure lead. But Rudy Fernandez was one of several players to shine for Madrid in a big third quarter as the visitors took the lead. But Fenerbahce regained control early in the fourth quarter and held on for a 75-69 home win. Lokomotiv Kuban Krasdorar and FC Barcelona Lassa opened their series the way it was expected, with a very intense battle. Barcelona led most of the way, but Lokomotiv rallied behind an outstanding Anthony Randolph, who got plenty of help from Malcolm Delaney. Randolph registered a double-double, and Delaney added 11 points and 7 assists to lead Lokomotiv to its first ever playoffs win, 66-61. Laboral Kutcha Vitoria Gastais and Panathinaikos Athens met in Spain and Miroslav Radulica took charge to give the Greens an early lead. But Yanis Borussis' introduction off the bench put Laboral in front and the home team built a double-digit lead. Laboral ran away with the game from that point and Panathinaikos' fourth-quarter efforts proved to be too little as the host celebrated an impressive 84-68 victory. Don't miss any games, subscribe now at EuroLeague TV.